Howdy folks, Moose here. A lot of gear hits my desk for me to check out, test, and I was going to do a simple blog post about this latest piece of gear the, to arrive here at the office, but I'm kind of excited about it. It's really too cool, and, and this is it. This little thing here, I mean, it is small. It weighs less than three quarters of a pound. What is it? It's the Jejun, and my apologies if I'm mispronouncing this. Went on the web even to listen to how to do it, but the Jejun, this is a 100 watt Molus 100 light. So it's a Molus 100 for 100 watt. Now I'm gonna turn it on at only 1% power. Yikes, that's 1% power. Uh, it goes up to 100%. It is an LED light of an incredible magnitude and versatility. Now it comes in this really cool kit. And it comes with some really cool, simple accessories, uh, like a reflector, which of course it, uh, you know, you put it on there and you turn it on, this is again 1%, turn the knob the right way. You can see it's supposed to be one meter away for its reading, uh, it's, uh, from the specifications. You can see I'm blown out. It is a lot of light. Uh, it is spectacular uh, light. It does uh, some really cool things. Now this little lot modifier simply attaches on here and it takes a second to find the little, cause I'm blind right now. I can't see the little guides on it. So I'm literally, I can't see anything folks. Um, it attaches on here. You have a nice light modifier with a grid. I'm gonna turn on 1% again. I'm gonna give it to Sharon, sit there and hold, and then you can, she's gonna point it at me. You can see from that distance, you know, now she's at uh, probably uh, one meter, what's happening. It's pretty amazing light. But the beauty of this thing, and, and this is, I, I can't emphasize this enough, is the fact that it's small, it's compact. You have all of this power, like I keep mentioning, it's only 1% is what you're seeing, you can completely change the color temperature and you can take it anywhere. It has three quarter threads on the bottom to mount it on any platform if you, you want. It has a app so you can put it remotely and control it via the app. It has three different types of power. You have the battery, which charges off USB-C. You can plug this into 120. You can plug it into USB-C and to the wall and, and run it. It's just an amazing, versatile little light. Now, the other thing it comes with is it has the ability to use any Bowens light modifier with this bracket, because it just goes onto the back, goes onto a stand. It's simply brilliant. Uh, it's small, it's light. Now, why would I personally want this unit? Well, with the small size, and I can't emphasize that small size, is that I can take this and put this under aircraft. I can light paint with it. Um, I tend to get a few more of these because it is just this constant light source that I can use in multiple ways. The most obvious is shooting a video. Is this something that you should get? Well, this unit, as you see it, with some of the accessories, is less than $250. It's very inexpensive. As I mentioned, it's very light. Um, you can uh, run it off any power source, any place. So it might be just the, uh, the perfect tool for you. Now, why have this rather than a light panel? Well, one is the, the physical size, right? You can put this in your camera bag. Most light panels with this kind of power are a whole lot bigger. Uh, next, with all the different light modifiers, and shapers that you're used to using, working on this, something you don't really find from a light panel. Uh, next, the thing that I can't uh, emphasize enough is it's just, it's just really well thought out. As I mentioned, there's all these stickers on it when you get it that says it's really hot, watch out for fire damage or fire danger. Uh, it has an active cooling system that's part of it. So even though I haven't figured out the, you know, I haven't got to the point where I've burnt myself or anything like that, but um, that warning is there. And that um, that's just, with this cooling system fan, I'm not sure it's a problem. But the other thing I really like about it, and I gotta figure out where I put it, oh, is that 
I can attach this uh, right to my Benro tripods. Uh, it's small, it's light, it works that way. When I'm doing zooms, I can attach it to my um, platypod via the same arm. So I have a light source right there. It's just a really simple, cool light that if you're like myself, you're kind of like a one man band and you have to do it all yourself. This makes it simple because with that app, you can just control it. Temperature, intensity, power. It's just a marvelous, marvelous product. Now, uh, this is uh, my last time to, to say this in virtue of the same the Chejun uh, Mullis 100, 100 watt light. Seriously, check it out. It is just really, really cool.